Hi, my name is Christina Xu. Today, I'm going to present a not quite famous but fundamental database called LevelDB. So, what is LevelDB? LevelDB is an open source on disk key value store written by Google Fellow Jeff Ding and Sanjay Gimawa. LevelDB stores key and values in arbitrary byte arrays, um, and data is stored by key. LevelDB is a NoSQL database, and like other NoSQL databases, it does not have a relational data model, uh, it does not support SQL queries, and not support for indexes. Application use LevelDB as a library, as it does not provide a server or command line interface. Uh, it stores data on file on disk, and it supports batch writes, uh, forward and backward iteration, and compression of data. LevelDB can write very fast. Um, it um, out outperforms uh, both uh, SQLites and um, um, uh, uh, Kyoto cabinets in writes operation and sequential order read operation. Um, and it can find very fast uh, as they utilize the binary search and the overall complexity is log in. So since uh, LevelDB and Redis are both key value store, um, let's compare some of their differences here. So Redis save uh, file every n seconds or on demand. Um, well, LevelDB store the data when the memory table is full. Uh, and Redis is essentially a big hash map, uh, but LevelDB is basically a um, sorted tree structure. And uh, LSM tree means uh, log structure merge tree and SS table stands for uh, sorted string table. Um, and Redis supported a lot of data structure like string, list, set, hash table, and sorted sets, uh, while LevelDB only support the basic uh, key value pairs. Um, and as for use case, Redis are mostly used as cache. Uh, well, LevelDB used as um, local storage based cache. And as for how to run, uh, Redis will run server and use client to talk to server. Um, and LevelDB uh, is basically an embedded library. So it's embedded in code. So here I'll do a simple example on how to use the LevelDB. So this is the code I wrote in C++. Um, and here is how I open the LevelDB. Um, and here is the key and the value. Um, and I use put to store the key value pair. And once it's successful, um, it will print this message. And uh, we use, utilize the key to find the value here. And it will also print the successful message. And I'll try to delete the key here. Um, and after I delete, I'll try to get um, and it will definitely throw an error, mes uh, error message and close the database. And um, I have already compiled the code and here is the binary. So yeah, it works as expected. So here is the write message. Um, and this is the read message, read successful message. And here is the error message I'm expecting. Uh, so after I delete the key and try to find it again, it will definitely throw an error message. 
yeah that's basically is the small demo um thank you very much for watching it and hope you enjoy the video and learn something about level db thank you